Hi, my name is Suba and I'm a math expert. And today we're gonna go over how to teach kindergartners about money. So this kind of seems a little bit complicated, but it's not so hard. Basically, some of the very basic skills that they're gonna be learning when they're in kindergarten is patterning, kind of recognizing, and sorting. So like sorting red colors from the blue colors. And we wanted to take and do the same thing with money. So the first thing that you wanna work on is recognizing and sorting. So for instance, sorting all the pennies together, sorting all the dimes together, just learning the name of the penny, learning the name of the dime, that sort of thing. Second thing you wanna do with them is practice that early math they've been learning in school and apply this to the money. So, for instance, counting out individual pennies, like counting out five cents, which they're gonna learn equals a nickel. And helping them make that connection through practicing early math. Which brings us to another big one, counting. Which is something a lot of kindergartners are gonna be focusing on and it's a great way to reinforce that math while learning the practical applications of that. So counting out $2, counting out $3, that sort of thing. And then of course, the fun of money, purchasing. Now this is where you can kind of get creative, kind of help your kid spark an interest in math uh, by playing games with them around the house. Like, hey, this piece of candy is three cents. Can you give me three cents? Or sometimes it helps to have them as your little helper when you're at the grocery store and they get to feel like they're doing something and say, hey, this is $5. Can you give me $5? Just little things to try and get them engaged. The last thing about money is budgeting, and it never hurts to get that in their heads too early. So. A fun way to do that is maybe to set up different piggy banks. Like one for saving and one for spending. Because a lot of kids just have one big piggy bank. But if we already help them start like categorizing how they're putting their money, it's going to help them in the future when they have to do that as adults. So that's a great way to help teach kindergartners about money. My name is Suba Gerwal, and thank you for taking an interest in math.